Hello YouTube, uh, Eugene Johnson aka Mortician Man 24 here. Um, as you recall in my last video I said that um, I traded for a bunch of magic stuff. I actually traded a season of scrubs to a 2015 uh, Core Magic the Gathering uh, Deck Builders Toolkit and Magic the Gathering uh, Cons of Takira event deck and this was the last thing in the trade um, it took a while to get this because the guy had it I guess in his closet but needless to say my neighbor come down just a few minutes ago and now the trade is complete so I uh, just wanted to show you guys what this is if a lot of you don't understand no. oh yeah by the way before I forget I want to give a special shout out and thank you to Invisigoth and uh, Tux Toys. Um, they are new subscribers and very, very appreciative of their subscribing to my channel. Um, this is in really good shape. I lucked out in this trade. Uh, well, it's upside down. This is my official Magic the Gathering uh, playmat. And as you can see, uh, this is the Born of the Gods series of Magic. Um, but I really like these. I have did some research on them when I found out what kind of uh, playmat I was getting. Um, and I love the artwork on this. Very beautiful. And therefore, I don't have to worry about my cards getting dirty or anything like that. Plus, it'll make a good mat to do reviews on. I mean, you know, movies or whatever else because I won't be able, uh, the DVD cases won't slide and anything else. But yes, this is my... Like I said, official Magic the Gathering Ultra Pro uh, <clears throat> playmat. And these are machine washable. If it gets if they get dirty in any way, you can throw them in the washer. Um, but the main thing that I would recommend from the videos I've watched is please make sure that you roll these. Because if you fold them, uh, they will tear up really easy, uh, especially the backs of them. Basically what this is is like a giant mouse pad, but um, I'm really, really, really awed by the quality of this. Uh, yes, I would recommend, recommend getting you an Ultra Pro, Pro Playmat. Uh, very very cool I must say and yeah I guess this could be considered a review I mean I haven't played on it but after filling the uh, material it's made out of like I said if you've got a mouse pad at home uh, fill the back of that and the top this is basically what this is made of same material but it is nice to know that my cards will always be uh, protected and not get sticky or anything like that plus guys <clears throat> excuse me within the next couple of weeks I will be doing some more reviews I have a DVD coming in the mail it's been held up for some reason which is probably by my stupid local post office uh, it's been held up and uh, I haven't really had a chance to check my mail today but um, We'll do that soon. I'm going to check my mail soon. Hopefully later tonight if I've got time. Uh, but my dad and my uncle and my neighbor that I got this from uh, was here earlier today. So yeah, I ain't really had time to do much. And if you heard a beep, that was my watch. Um, but <clears throat> And from talking to my fiance Tammy last night 
uh, here shortly I will be doing more unboxings because I guess the reason that I got into magic cards here lately is because a lot of people are selling off their collections and stuff because they're getting out of it um, but you can find some really good deals on Amazon or eBay wherever you shop at for magic cards but yeah I'm still amazed at the size of this thing and the quality uh, well of course I've got it on my bed right now but I'm sure if you put it on a table it's gonna look really really nice um, and definitely will protect your cards from anything so yeah I would definitely recommend this but anyway guys just wanted to make a quick video and review of this um, you'll be seeing this mat much more in my fu in the future of my videos especially when I get new magic cards I will take them out and put them on uh, this mat to review uh, also guys I love collecting comic books but it would take me literally months to review my entire collection of comic books because altogether now I've probably got 4,000 so yeah it'd be a long long time and a lot of work but be sure to look out for this coming weekend because I am planning on doing a DVD collection overview that's just the ones downstairs uh, mostly my horror stuff and I'm also going to try to figure out how to do a slideshow so I can show you guys the pictures of me at uh, numerous conventions with uh, my favorite horror stars I'm gonna try to do that <clears throat> and also uh, got a lot of positive feedback with me being in running away from the unknown I hope you guys checked out the teaser on YouTube all you gotta do is put in running away from the unknown and you will see me and if you see the teaser uh, pointing to the toxic Avenger <laughs> that's actually my finger <laughs> and I'm the one that's basically staring down the big zombie guy in the trail in the teaser so I'd really appreciate if you guys checked out that video give it a like um, but um, <clears throat> yeah guys just want to make a quick video last time it took forever to upload because it was 20 minutes or something but again once again to Invisigoth and Tux Toys I really appreciate the subs that you guys give me Invisigoth you've got really cool videos I really enjoy your info Tux you do too uh, you guys make some great content any of my subscribers they need to run over to Invisigoth and Tux Toys channels um, because they do have some good informative reviews on like uh, Transformers Pokemon they like they're more into the Pokemon stuff but me like I said I've played this game since I was 15 and it just brings back a lot of childhood memories so yeah if you guys are into Pokemon or uh, <clears throat> dinosaur toys video game toys Tux toys and Invisigoth are definitely your two cups of tea I really enjoy watching their videos um, but yeah guys I really appreciate the subs but uh, yep and definitely loving this mat but anyway guys this is Mortician Man 24 aka Eugene Johnson uh, wishing you all to have a good day and take care